Hey guys, today is the day after the day after Thanksgiving. And my little family and I, we went to, we're in Yosemite National Park. And I wanted to show you guys just some things that we had touched on in a previous videos or in previous classes that is also true for Yosemite. So this is Cook's Meadow and we can have our lovely cameraman pan around this area. And in this meadow, we've got lots of milkweed. Now, this milkweed is going to be a native milkweed. It's not gonna be the milkweed that we have in the butterfly garden. That milkweed is a tropical milkweed, um, but because of the climate change, it seems to be maybe one of the only ones kind of thriving in our area as it gets hotter and hotter. So this milkweed, um, <laughs> this is what it's called. I don't know if I'm gonna try and say it. I'll have to practice that. Asclepius speciosa. And this is common at this higher elevation. So it's the same, you know, monarchs still love this milkweed and the seed pods are way, way, way bigger than the ones that we have in the butterfly garden. They're also, here's a, a piece of one. They're also bumpy, almost like scaly. And they dry to a gray rather than drying to a brown like ours do. And the just sheer amount of seeds and fluff that can come out of a seed pod uh, exactly this size I mean they're massive probably this big is huge so I'll show you over here in just a second the milkweed in the field and the meadow and let's see if I can zoom in on some so this is probably the best I can do but these are the milkweed plants and you can see the white stuff is their fluff and that's what's kind of showing up really brightly on this camera. Another thing to mention is that meadows are wetlands. So this whole area during the rainy season gets pretty flooded. And it, obviously it snows up here too. And then in the spring when the snow thaws and there's runoff, this area becomes very, very wet. And you can tell it's a wetland by some of the plants you see. We've got, let's see if I can find some equisetum. Equisetum, also known as horsetail. There's lots, oh good. Here's an equisetum. Oh, hi Cricket, yes. Cricket, hi. Cricket, so here's hey. equisetum. This is that horsetail, and equisetum lives in wet zones. So if you see equisetum, then you know that you're going to be in a wetland. We also saw mullen off the path, so I won't be able to show it on camera, but I'll insert a picture of mullen here. And mullen is a kind of plant that requires just a ton of water. So you'll definitely see it closer to areas that have lots and lots of water. 